Welcome to Hillsboro. Just about finished with Kansas. It only took, uh, let's see, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, today, Sunday. Of lots of effort. But I've successfully crossed Kansas. I've crossed the Great Plains. Started in Fort Collins on Monday. Today again is Sunday. Yesterday was September 11th. Today is the 12th. My heart went out to the people who lost their lives. I was riding yesterday. I was certainly thinking of them and their families. I'm 13 miles from Missouri. I'm many more miles from the Mississippi River, but that'll be my next goal. I've had some dips as far as how I was feeling. This morning was not an exception, but I have done quite well as far as covering mileage and also taking in the journey as much as I can capturing some images for friends and family and strangers too and also pausing long enough to meet people in these wonderful little towns in Kansas they've really been spectacular towns like Woodbine I tell you it's so small you better use Google Google Maps to find that one Bennington Eskridge of course went and visited my my grandfather's hometown yesterday in Bradford Kansas that's a ghost town now and on and on, I could spend so much time just talking about small towns in Bradford, sorry, in Kansas. But I must move forward, so that's what I'll do today at mile 50 for the day now in Hillsboro, Kansas. I'm going to press on momentarily, and we'll see where this day ends. Last night I rode into the dark, finished in Clinton, Kansas, camped at Clinton Lake after having a nice meal and talking to some locals that prepared it there in Clinton. Totally unexpected. Just happened to be a shop open, the only one in town when I got there. Set up my tent in the dark. Woke up at 7.16. <laughs> and so, yeah, I pedaled right into the heat and part of the reason I just wasn't feeling good, I'm sure. But when you come out of a space like that through perseverance and determination, good feels even better. So I'll take that on the road for the rest of the day today, on the gravel roads too. And I'll see what else I can capture for my soul and for, for my heart and for anybody who happens to be watching my videos.